Happy Saturday, everyone. This is Amy of Thrifty Mama Scraps, and today I'm going to do an unboxing of a couple things that I ordered from Peachy Cheap. Um, the first thing I'm going to show you is this Carpe Diem collection. Um, it is a Disney-themed collection. And... I have some Disney photos that I want to scrapbook soon. I actually have a Disney album for, for um, a collection of all the Disney photos. We've been to Disney several times, and I want to put them all in one album. I actually have not scrapbooked any of my Disney photos. And so um, I have some embellishments that are Disney-themed, but I saw this on Peach peachy cheap I think it was $6.99 or $7.99 something like that and so I ordered it um the first thing I'm going to show you is this washi tape it's just a black washi tape with cameras on it which um I use for planning I I don't normally scrapbook with washi tape I use it in both of my planners, my homeschooling planner and in my um, general everyday planner all the time. So, this one's called Photo Op. This is a traveler's notebook from Carpe Diem. And um, this I think I'm going to use... Um, for our next trip to Disney, I think we're going back next year, either to Disneyland or Disney World. Um, our son lives, our oldest son lives in Arizona, and he's only about three hours from Disneyland, so we have never been to Disneyland before, so hopefully um, we'll get to go, and the kids can um, get signatures from the characters in here. They have another book that they... Um, have used over the years for signatures but I may use that for and then decorate it and so forth for that these are decorative clips say cheese three seems to be the name of the collection I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep them on these clips or if I'm gonna just take them off and use the epoxy shapes um, for scrapbooking but they're super cute. I'm I'm super excited about the castle, the coffee cup. Um, I do like this heart. So those will be fun to use. Then they give you some sticky notes, and it looks like there's a pad of quite a few of them. There's itinerary magic memories to do. These are perfect for um for scrapbooking pages and journaling. This is what I mainly bought the kit for, these stickers from Carpe Diem. And I'm probably going to um, use them for scrapbooking um, my Disney photos, but I'm also going to use them in my planner um, when we plan our next trip because inside this pad, it has a countdown, which I absolutely love. And so I'm definitely going to use this to plan our next Disney trip. Whether we go to Disney World or to Disneyland, I'm not sure yet. So, but these are perfect for clustering. There's lots of pages, lots of areas that you can um, write little things on. This is actually a planner pad, but I'm going to use it mostly for scrapbooking and then... A little bit from planning probably these little tiny ones I'll use for planning but you never know some of these are really I like the little tiny stickers for um, clustering so and then this I was really excited about too these are all a whole bunch of little um, little blurbs that you can put um, on a scrapbook page so you have go see ride planning for big magic um, just hanging with my crew Ridiculously amazing weekend getaway. It's a final countdown. A dream is a wish your heart makes. Um, what are some other ones that I love? Um, laughter is time timeless. Imagination has no age, and dreams are forever. That's a quote from Walt Disney. 
So fairy tales do come true. It can happen to you if you're young at heart. So I absolutely love the, these stickers and I cannot wait to use them. Those are perfect for my Disney pages. And then like these, these are just um, little check boxes. Um, I'll probably just use in my planner and probably these little tiny ones too. So and the weekend banners, of course, I'll use in my planner because I don't use those in my scrapbook. But you get quite a few pages. I don't know if that's is that the last page. I can't tell if that's the last page, but anyways, you can kind of see here it's a close up on the back of everything you get in this sticker pad. which I think you get actually quite a lot. And this is why I love Peachy Cheap because you don't pay a whole lot of money. The shipping is about $6. It's not terrible. Um, might be a little different in Canada. I'm sure it's probably a little bit higher. Seems like their shipping cost is quite a bit higher than the US. But here in the US, it's about $6, so. That is my Carpe, Carpe Diem kit that I purchased from Peachy Cheap. Second thing I purchased from Peachy Cheap is this Illustrated Faith Collection. This is my first of the Illustrated Faith Collections. I wanted some paper to do like some Easter photos and things like that. Um, and this kit did not disappoint me. This was also probably around $7.99. It wasn't that bad. Um, for, or maybe it was, it could have been eight, eight or nine ninety nine, but less than ten bucks, anyways. And that's not bad at all for a 12 by 12 kit. So this is the Illustrated Illustrated Faith Collection Delight in His Day. And I don't know if you're like me, but this cover page, I cut all these apart and use them, all these pieces, because it's the same cardstock, and um, why waste it? There's so many things. I cut this out and usually make it a banner, cut Faith out, use it as a banner. Definitely cut all of these out separately and use them. Probably even use this as a, like, a portion of a circle so none of this goes to waste and on the back of it we have a patterned piece of paper so this is exclusive collection kit bonus paper it's just a bunch of hearts and it's really pretty this would actually work really good in a Disney on a Disney page too okay so this one is called just a ticket Count my blessings, ever faithful to him. So many different tickets. Um, enjoy God's work. So you could cut all of these apart and use them separately, and it would give you a ton of embellishments. Or the back side is just this plain pink and red, um, red scallop. So very pretty. And here's another ticket page if you want to cut it apart. Just a ticket. Same sayings over again, but a different back. So the B side of, oh, no, it's exactly the same. Never mind. So they give you two pieces. So if you want to use this as a background and then cut one of them apart, you have that option because you have two sheets. Um, this paper is called, let's see, is there a name on this one? Um, maybe it's on the other side. Yep. This one's called Raise Me Up. And this just, he puts a song in my heart, so very blessed. Hot air balloons. Um, if you're not a religious person, you can use this in so many other ways. Um, you can cut up the hot air balloons. Our town does a balloon festival every year. So that would be good for 
those kind of pages. And then this is a whole bunch of ovals and they remind me of Easter eggs. So I might use this on an Easter page because it just looks like a whole bunch of eggs to me. Or they could be balloons too if you wanted to use it on a birthday page. And here is the same page. You must get two sheets of each. This is the first time looking at it, so I'm not, I wasn't exactly sure. This one's called Sprinkled with Bliss. And it's ice cream cones with sprinkles, which I absolutely love. You can cut these ice cream cones out from embellishments, or you could use it as a background page. And then this is a bunch of those sprinkles. I love that page. That is so pretty. Really cute birthday, Easter-y type spring colors. Very, very cute and the same. Again, and then this one is called Top Notch and it's a sheet of banners. Lots of them. And like, like I said, if you're not religious, you could use the ones that, that don't have, um, the little sayings on it. Some of these you could use for anything. Happy hearts are the best kind. That's pretty universal. Believe. You can believe in anything. Um, I've got spirit. That could be a school one. You could actually color cover this up with a stripe if you didn't want Jesus on there or if you didn't want a cross on there. Um, my family is religious, so it does. Um, this works perfectly for us. But um, if you're not, it is very versatile and you can use it in a lot of different ways. Um, this looks like just a bunch of yellow um, dashes. Kind of different size, well, vertical dashes, I should say. So, really pretty. I love this paper. I love this yellow. I'm hoping I'm getting the right color. I have my odd light on it, but. Never know. Sometimes, sometimes the color is off, even though it's daytime when I'm filming this. Okay, so here's another one of this one. And then the next one, you get an awful lot of 12 by 12 paper in here, and I love that they give you two each. That's awesome. Okay, this one's called Happy Heart, and this one says, Blessed, joyful, love, praise, amen, blessed, love, hope, believe, happy, faith, prayer, lots of different things. Um, I will probably cut some of these out and not use this particular page as a background page because there's just so much to cut out and use as an embellishment. And then the back of it is just a black and white dot, which would be perfect for a Disney page, actually. So, and this side would be perfect for um, Easter. This one is called Believe It, and this is just a whole bunch of candy. And you could cut those out. You could use those in so many different ways. Easter candy, Halloween candy, um, Christmas candy. So many different ways. And these are just multicolored hearts. They're really pretty. Happy hearts are the best kind. Looks like it says over and over again. That is beautiful paper. I love that. I love hearts. And then this one's the same. This one is border straps. 12 by 12. We've got elephants. That would be good for a circus or um, zoo page. You've got your hot air balloons, your ice cream cones, and then some sayings that say, find joy, hope, fun, happy, love, and every day. Pretzels, tickets. So this could be used for a fair, carnival, Disney World, you name it. And then this one is kind of a lime green dot. Love that. Okay, this one's the same. And then here's some cut apart cards. Um, and these are three by four cards. So forever faithful to him. His word lifts me up. Jesus. Everyone who believes is set free from every sin. Acts 13 39. And then these are just some decorative ones. This one says Ecclesiastes um, 8 15. Believe some hearts. A Ferris wheel. This has got a church kind of in the city background. 
hearts, um, faith, hope, love, and some more of those. So if you, um, if you are secular, you could put like a enamel dot over the cross, or you could, um, cut that off and just use the city part or just cut the, you could use that for a wedding, different things like that. There's lots of ways. I, I cut these up a lot of times if you just want to use the balloons or, or whatever, but and then this one is pink with red slashes. So, and that's, that was the last piece of that. And then you get a sticker sheet, 12 by 12 sticker sheet. So you got your borders, um, yellow stickers, yellow um, alphabet stickers. And then you've got some different types of um, stickers on here that match the paper. So you've got Adventure, Cherish, Remember, Delight, Happy Hearts, Great Memories, Counting My Blessings, Find Joy in Every Day, Faith, Hope, and Love, um, Friends, Happy, uh, Blessed, Such a Great Day, Delight in Today, Savor the Sweetness, Praise, Yes, Wear Love, Wherever You Go. Give me sunshine and sprinkles. So very cute very very cute set and then <clears throat> also with that kit um which i think you got a lot honestly um are all these little this is the ephemera pack it's delight in the day 37 pieces of ephemera and it's just like pieces that are on the paper so there's a die cut of that there's a banner have faith enjoy enjoy his blessings Another banner, a Bible, heart, a banner, some palm trees, some banner. So I can see right now that I can use this for Easter and for some of my Disney album. Joy comes in the morning, some sprinkles, a cloud that says joy comes from above, then a candy, and then some banner strips these have some bible verses on it um faith hope love he lifts me up a balloon a heart another banner that says god is good and there's a couple more cotton candy an elephant um ferris wheel balloons with the bible Hearts, um, a little scallop piece. We've got ever faithful to him. This one says happy. Says praise. Pretzels. A heart. Another scallop border. And a cloud with a heart and a heart so you get quite a bit for that for that big of a collection I'm pretty excited to use that one um, the last thing I want to talk about is if you've ever tried these yogurts whoa wants to roll around with me these wee yogurts by YoPlay they come in these glass containers and these labels come off really easily so I have quite a few of them because they were on sale at my hy V, and I just took the labels off and you can use them to store your little tiny bits. So I have quite a lot of them and I probably have enough that I can separate quite a few embellishments with colors. So I'll probably just, you know, put my little tiny bits in there and then that helps quite a bit. So I thank you all for watching this video and I hope you have a great Saturday. I hope that you get some scrapbooking done today. That is my hope. I have a little bit of cleaning to do in my office because it's starting to get a little bit disorganized and I need to get my stuff out for Easter to decorate the house. I'm a little late in the game. So um, I hope you have a great day and thanks for watching. Bye.